going out online? No. Yes, good morning and welcome, especially to those of you who cannot join us in person, but are joining us via WBTV 12. And a warm welcome to everyone who's gathered with me today. My name is Chaplain Kathy Nixie, and I am Director of Spiritual Life here at UMH. Today's worship takes the form of a hymn sing. Those of you that are at home, the words will be shown across your screen, and I hope that you join in in singing with us. I opened up my hymnal to number 593, and I'd like us to start with that, but then I'm going to be taking some requests. 593, here I am, Lord. song. 
Have you ever thought of saying to God, here I am, Lord, use me the way that you want to. Here I am, Lord. It's us saying to God, I'm available. I surrender to what you want. I want to serve you and others according to your will. Here I am, Lord. Okay, who would like to suggest the next hymn? Connie. 500. 500. 500. Something tells me she knew that in advance. <laughs> Let's see here. It's got five verses, and we're going to sing verses one through four. in the 300s in the garden it is 314 314 in the garden let's see here it's taking me a while to get there fingers okay 314 in the garden and we'll sing all three verses.
to sing? <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, let's try uh, 553 and do the first three verses. 553 five, and are we yet alive? 553 five, verses 1 through 3. So, Carol, would you play the whole melody for us through once, and then we'll come in, and I'll, I'll lead you in coming in. Although I love, blessed be the tie that binds our hearts in Christian love. Okay, the whole thing, we need the whole thing. Doug and Carol have been married. Now, I noticed something. Yes. I noticed something. Doug picked 553, five, five, and Carol turned to 533. Three. Did you notice it was the same tune? Now, that's what I call being connected. Either to each other or up above or both. 
I'd say both. Just a little context on that. You know, an annual conference of the United Methodist Church is held every year. And when you gather, this is the one hymn that is sung uh, by all the members of the conference. And so it's, it's sung once a year anyway. But, so I thought it was an opportunity. <laughs> I think it's a great opportunity. Who would like to select a song next? Marion. 77. 77. So much better than 666. 77. I'm just joking, really. You are really. Carol said, I'm really good. She's not sure she's following what all I say, but she likes it. It's me in the morning and all the time. Oh, 7-7, seven, seven, how great thou art. I think this is Mary and my husband's favorite. Al's favorite song? He used to sing it. Al. Her husband used to sing yes. it. Yes. I remember Al, Marion's husband, and his beautiful voice. I suspect every hymn was his hymn that he liked to sing. <laughs> yeah. yep. We're going to sing all four verses of hymn 77, How Great Thou Art. I see the stars. 
I think we have time for one more, and it's going to be, It Is Well With My Soul. And that one is 377. 377. Let's see here. It's a good thing it takes me so long to get here. It gives everyone a chance to get there. Now, um, hmm, I think we better sing it all. and loving God, we are so thankful for your presence with us. We thank you, Lord, that you are in our hearts, that you sing through us, regardless of whether we consider ourselves to have a great voice or a voice that, well, I've heard someone describe themselves as a frog. <laughs> Fortunately, God, you say that we should make a joyful noise and we thank you for this time of worship where through song we are able to remind ourselves of who you are, how great you are, and how abundant is your love for us. And we are given an opportunity to connect our hearts to your hearts. Thank you, God, for truly you are great. And only because of you, it is well in our souls. And now we pray together the prayer that Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, 
on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. And as this time of worship draws to a close, may we go out filled with love to share with others. May we go out with peace that passes all understanding. May we go out with hearts that sing so that we are Jesus light and love, hands and feet in this hurting world. Bless us this day, O oh God and help us to bless you. Amen. Amen.